what's going on YouTube. I decided that I'm going to give them one more shot. I'm talking about Royal Farms. I'm talking about this chicken sandwich because it's a good sandwich. And I had a taste for it today. And I'm telling you, I'm not, I'm not going to, I don't know how to act. I don't know, I don't know how it's going to be if I have to give these people up because they start making garbage sandwiches. But I got one. Let's open it up and let's hope that it looks good. Please. Let's see, look at this. Look, I've got meat falling out. This is the way it's supposed to be. Look at that. I've got meat falling out from all of the sides. This is what this is what I've come to expect. That's what I'm talking about. That's what the sandwich is supposed to look like. I don't know if it's just day shift or you just got... See, I don't even trust that kid now. Because... This is what I'm used to. This is what I'm used to when it comes to this sandwich. There's no need for me to, to, to take a bite out of it and taste it. I know it tastes good. I need it to look good. I need the meat to be there. I'm happy. You saved yourselves, Royal Farms. You, there was no reply. There was no... And I, and I put this out on Twitter, too. You didn't even respond to that. So, so your customer service is failing you. But... You got you got liars. You know what? He was probably he was now that night he was he was probably too lazy and didn't want to drop any more chicken. So he was going to use what he had and was going to try and make me think that that was the best piece. Because I know. Look at that. Look at how much meat was in that. I'm happy. You didn't redeem yourselves 100 percent Royal Farms, but I'm happy enough to at least still give you my business. That's it for tonight. Peace.